Hey guys, so today I want to show you how you can create Quora spaces. I'm going to show you the best Quora spaces to create and you can use these spaces to promote affiliate products. So this is going to be a full tutorial on how to create Quora spaces. And the second thing that I'm going to show you is to design the space. So this involves the icon, the cover photo, the details that you can add. Thirdly, I'm going to show you how to fill the space with content, the best content that you can use so that you can get your space up and running. Then I'm going to show you how to find the products to promote, affiliate products to promote. And lastly, I'm going to show you how you can answer the questions in those niches. So this is going to be an amazing step-by-step -step tutorial. So be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. Now, the reason why you want to use Quora Spaces is because Quora is a powerful platform, okay? Quora is one of the best places that you can get free traffic. You can get massive free traffic here on Quora. This is what I use to drive traffic to my website and also to my YouTube channel. I also use it to promote affiliate products as well. And just to show you my contents and stats over the years, as you can see, I've generated over 52,000 views here on Quora. I have 75 upvotes, 49 comments. So I've been very, very active here on Quora. This is a place that you can easily generate views and drive traffic to your affiliate products and make money, all right? So to create a space here on Quora, you want to open spaces centered around one of the biggest online niches, okay? And these niches are health, wealth, and relationships, okay? So you want to create spaces based on any of those niches, okay? Because if you look at health, there's so many people around the world who have health problems. There's always someone who is sick, maybe a family member who is sick, and there are also those people who are trying to get healthy, who are trying to stay fit. Health is an evergreen niche that you want to get into, okay? If you look at wealth, there are so many people who want to get wealthy. Almost everyone wants to get rich. People want to be financially free. So if you get into wealth, you are bound to make tons of money. If you look at relationships, there are so many people in relationships. Almost everyone is in a relationship, whether it's mutual relationships, couples, husband and wives. These are all types of relationships that you can promote products and even create spaces for here on Quora, okay? So the niche that I wanted to focus on today on today's tutorial is on health, okay? So I'm going to create a health space and the way you're going to go about it, you're just going to um, create an account here on Quora. If it's your first time on Quora, just create an account. You're going to click on create space over here. So it's going to give you this pop-up screen here where you can enter the name of your space. So you can call it whatever. I'm just going to call this this is healthy, okay? And then now I'm going to enter a description, just a brief description. So this is basically just to show people what they're going to expect if they join. So I can say, find the best tips to stay healthy, okay? And then just click on create. So here it's going to tell you to invite contributors to your space. So contributors are people that are already, you're already connected with here on Quora, okay? Usually I don't invite contributors, but if you wish, you can go ahead and do that. Otherwise, I'll just click on skip. All right. So once you have done that, it's going to open for you your space. So this is how it's basically going to look like. Okay. So this is your space. You have your logo over here. You have your banner. You have your title here. And then you have your bio over here or your description. So your space is pretty much empty. Okay. And what we're going to do next is to design our space. Okay. We're going to add our logo and we're going to add our cover photo. All right. So to do that, just scroll down over here. Click on settings. And as you can see on your right hand side here, you have your general. So you have your name. You can also change your name from here. You can also change your description. Here is your URL. Okay. The URL is up actually over here. This is the URL of your space. Okay. You can change it if you want. Um, details. You can also edit details. This is optional. You don't have to enter anything here. But if you want maybe something that you want to add on, you can answer. Uh, you can enter over here. Otherwise, just cancel it. You have your visual. So here's where you can now enter your icon and your cover photo so for your icon you can generate the right dimension for an icon using canva okay so you're going to head over to canva this is canva.com and here on canva they actually have a logo uh template so we'll just scroll over here you can either scroll or just type it over here others just click on this logo and this is what i love about canva is that they have tons of free beautiful designed logo templates that you can actually use here Okay, so you can customize any of these logos as well. So let me see if they have anything to do with the health. So I'll just type here health. All right. So they have, you know, that health theme logo. So you can just basically use any uh, logo over here. It doesn't really matter. 
because like I said, you can also customize. Um, I'm just going to go with this one here, the fitness coaching. And then I can just rename it over here. I can say this is healthy. All right. And this is how it's going to look like. So this was the name of my space. And then maybe I can remove this. Okay, I don't think I I don't think I need this. Maybe I can reduce the size of the image, not the not the text, but the image. I'll bring this up, shrink this. Let's also make this smaller. Okay, just like that. Bring this down here. Okay. All right, so that's perfect. You can further customize it, but I'll just leave it like this for now. And then I'll just save it. Okay. JPG, click on download. All right, so now I can head back to Quora. I'll click on icon over here, select my logo. Okay, so sometimes it takes a while to generate the image, so I'll just give it some time. Meanwhile, we can continue and edit our cover photo. We're going to use Canva as well. So come back over here to Canva. And then here we can just type a Quora cover photo if they have it. So let's see. So they only have Facebook cover cover photo. So this can also work, but let's just go ahead and see just in case they have Quora cover photo. Okay, so they don't have a Quora cover photos. Uh, let's just go back and let's use Facebook cover photos. Alright, so they're usually just the same dimension, so that's the reason why I'm using Facebook cover photos. So they also have templates here. You can go ahead and use any of these templates. Okay, so I'm just going to quickly select any um over here. Let me just use this one. Then I'll click on customize this template. So again, you can just customize it the way you want. Um, I'm just going to edit this text here to my logo theme, which is this is healthy. Okay, and for the logo, since we already have a logo, we can also use that logo over here. So I'm going to first ungroup this. Okay, I'm going to delete this. Uh, we still have our logo here. And I'm going to bring this back here, upload it back to Canva, and then just select. Okay, click it like that, make it smaller, bring it up over here. Okay, and then this one here, I can edit it. I can say, I can just use the same description that I used on space. So Tips to tips to stay healthy. Okay, maybe I can add best or get the best tips. Get the best tips to stay healthy. All right, I'm just going to remove this right here. All right, so now I can just save this. Click on download. Okay, I'm going to select JPG and click on download. All right, so now we can come back to Quora and click on this. Select it. All right. Now, the thing with Quora uh, cover photos is that it doesn't let you actually adjust the cover photo like Facebook does. So you have to go back to the design, okay? Because as you can see, if you come back over here, this text is uh, has been cut from here. So you can come back to the design and then just drag your text in the middle. Okay? So that all of it shows. All right? So even the logo as well, if you come back, as you can see the logo has been hidden, it's actually also cut. So we can drag our logo, maybe bring it down here. All right. And also the slogan. Okay. Maybe I can shrink this down just a little bit. Okay. So something like that. Now I can download it. Come back to Quora. All right. Let's now remove this and select the new one. All right. So it's better. At least it's showing the text, not only the logo, but you now know how to adjust it. So it automatically saves everything. Now, once you're done, you can head back to your space. Just click on this. All right. And this is how it's going to look like. And then now once you're done, it's now time to fill up your space with content. Okay. You now want to enter content and the types of content that you want to enter are valuable content. Okay. You want to enter valuable content. That is how you're going to drive more traffic because people are going to look for value on your content. All right. So what type of content can we create under health? Now, the best way to find content for your space are on questions, okay? These are popular questions under health. So in order to find those questions, you can just head up over here, click on search quarter, and then just type health. Okay, now it's going to be based on your niche. Once you've done that, just click on enter, and you're going to scroll down over here, okay? And then you're going to see the questions over here. So these are the top questions 
that you want to answer all right as you can see this one here has 4.7k answers and it has 3.2k followers okay so you want to answer this question okay and you don't have to answer the question yourself you can use chat gpt to do that for you so you can highlight this let's just copy this question okay let's go to chat gpt and then just paste your question over here and then just click on enter all right so chat gpt has answered for us this question so it says here yeah, the best way to stay healthy is to adopt a holistic approach that includes a combination of healthy habits here are some tips to help you stay healthy and then it has the tips over here so very well answered it has all the six tips so we can just copy all these okay but before we paste this on quora we want to check for plagiarism all right because sometimes chat gpt uses plagiarist content so you want to be really really careful because quora can easily detect for plagiarism and once they do that they're going to delete your answer so we're going to use a prompt we're going to use a prompt here on chat gpt i'm just going to click on new chat now this is an extension actually it's called ai prm chat gpt prompts okay this extension has now over 3000 prompts they keep adding more prompts every day so we're going to look for a plagiarism prompt over here you're just going to type over here on search plagiarism okay then you're going to scroll down over here you have plagiarism checker so this is the one that you want to use so just click on this and then you're going to paste your answer over here and then click on enter okay so as you can see it says no plagiarism detected so we are good to go we can continue and use this answer so we're going to come back here and as you can see here, I had actually answered this question some time back. But what you're going to expect is a button like this. So answer, 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 answer. I've not answered any of these. So I'm just going to show you how you can go about it. I'm going to just click on edit draft. Okay, I'm just going to delete all of these. And then we're going to paste our answer just like that. Okay. Once you're done, just click on post. And as you can see, you now have your answer over here. Now, when people search for what is the best way to say healthy, they're going to find your answer and if they like the answer they're going to click your link over here which will direct them to your profile once they enter your profile of course they're going to see your space and that is how you can drive traffic to your space so you can keep doing this answering more of these popular questions another way that you can find popular questions is just by clicking on your profile over here click on ads manager click on new campaign okay you're going to enter a name over here for your campaign don't worry we're not actually creating any ad just enter your name over here scroll down over here and then just click on continue okay you're also going to enter your ad set name over here all right then scroll down over here and then here you're going to click on questions okay then you're going to click on bulk ad and then here you're going to type your niche okay so in my case it's health all right then i'll click on continue and then as you can see these are the most popular questions as you can see the number of views that this one gets so this one is what is the best diet for healthy living it gets between 20,000 to 30,000 views all right and then you have is vaping bad for your health this is 4,000 4,500 then you have this as well so these are the questions that you actually want to answer and also create content on all right because the first one was actually just answering a question you can actually use these to create content for your space so you can just copy this question like this all right just copy that and then come back to chat gpt all right click on new chat again and i'm still going to use this same prompt the ai prm prompt okay i'm going to delete this plagiarism okay and then i'm going to use this prompt over here okay this one is called write best smart ad call to rank number one on google now this is a very powerful prompt here it has over 600k views which means it's very popular and you can actually use this prompt to rank on the first page of google okay and with quora you can actually do that you can rank on the first pages there are actually some uh, articles that rank on the first pages from quora all right so you can do the same thing so you can just select this and then you're going to paste your question over here your quora question then just click on enter all right so it's completed with our article writing our article so you scroll to the top you can see it starts with an introduction so what is the best diet for healthy living this is a question that has been asked time and time again and for good reasons as we strive towards living longer and healthier lives our diets play a crucial role in achieving this goal okay and then it goes on and on and on and then it has the first topic over here so it has the mediterranean diet it goes on to write about the mediterranean diet it has a dash diet it has a vegan diet put uh, paleo diet flexitarian diet 
Now you can go on by clicking continue if you want to write a longer article. Okay, but I'm just going to leave it like this for now. And as you can see, this is a very, very powerful prompt that you can find under the AI PRM extension. So if you want to use this extension, you can just download it from Google. Okay, the Google Chrome Web Store. Or you can just head over to my website. All right. So that is robertokello.com. You hover over AI extensions, click on chat GPT Chrome extensions. You're going to scroll down. You're going to see it's actually the first one over here. Okay, so AI PRM for chat GPT. And then you're going to click on download AI PRM extension. Okay, so a very, very powerful extension. I recommend everyone using chat GPT 3 to install AI PRM. It's going to make your work so much easier and you're going to be so much more productive. Okay, so I'm just going to copy this. I'm going to copy this whole article. I'm just going to copy that. Again, make sure you check for plagiarism. You can go back and use the same extension, use the plagiarism checker, but I'm just going to skip this step for now. I'm going to head over to my space. Okay, and then I can just click on this and then just paste my article there. And you can go on and add, if you want to add anything on top of these, you can go on and do that. All right. now. Before clicking on post, you can also add affiliate links. You can add affiliate products. And here is where you can promote affiliate products. Okay, now the products that you want to promote, of course, are going to be related to your niche, whatever it is that you're talking about over here. And you're going to find your affiliate products from any affiliate network. I'm going to be using ClickBank for this example. And I'm just going to go to the health category. I'm going to click on that. I'm going to click on health and fitness. Okay, so these are the products that I can actually promote. And I'm going to use this one here, which is the Alpilene. And the Alpilene pays $134. So I'm just going to open Alpilene. And here is where you want to get the description for your link. Okay, because you can't just paste, you can't just um, copy paste a naked link like that. You want to actually mask your affiliate link. All right, so this one says the Alpine, the Alpine secret for healthy weight loss. Here it says support healthy weight loss. With Alpilene's propriety, blend of six powerful Alpine nutrients and plants backed by clinical research. So here we can say something like, find out how you can cut weight or find out how you can lose weight with a blend of six powerful Alpine nutrients and plants backed by clinical research. Okay, that'll be a very catchy um, sentence. So I can come back here and say, okay, find out how. Find out how you can lose weight fast. Let's come back again um, using a blend of six powerful alpine nutrients. Okay, powerful alpine nutrients backed by clinical research. Uh, alpine nutrients and plants backed by clinical research. Okay. So we have our sentence. Now this whole sentence here can be a link. Okay. Or you can just maybe link one or two words here. Maybe if you just want to link this one here, you can do that. But personally, I would link the whole thing. So in order to do that, I will just highlight it like this. Like, um, okay, just like this. Click on this A and A. Click on this link over here. And here is where we're going to paste our affiliate link. So let's grab it from ClickBank here. Click on uh, Promote. Create hop link. Okay, and then click on Copy. And then come back to our space and then paste it right there okay and then click on add okay now as you can see we have the sentence linked so this is how you can do it guys this is how you can actually create very simple articles on your space you can also add images if you want okay just to make it lively otherwise this is how you can do it and once you're done you can just click on post and then now as you can see you have your first article on your space okay so I highly recommend that you create spaces. Spaces are very powerful here on Quora and not just spaces answering questions as well on your niche. Okay, so you can do it two ways. You can answer questions and you can also create articles on those questions. And again, you want to target uh, the popular questions okay, that you're going to find here. But what you really want to do is to answer all of them. It doesn't matter um, the number of views. Okay, we have this one which has only 100 to 250. You also want to answer these questions as well. Okay, because at the end of the day, they add up to traffic to your space. All right, guys. Now, if you want to download more Chat GPT Chrome extensions, just like the AI PRM for Chat GPT, I have them here on my website. I've listed actually 10 powerful Chat GPT Chrome extensions that you can use 
to make your life so much easier when using chat gpt and if you want to find out how you can get more free traffic sources check out this video right here here i show you the best websites that you can use and how you can use them to drive traffic to your websites and affiliate links thanks for watching see you on the next one